Hello, this is Mr. Kent of MrKent.com. And as some of you may know, I recently purchased a Bebop 2 Power drone. And because I already had a Bebop 2 and it's been great, uh, I haven't had really any issues with it. Although I did crash it once and nobody knows why. Uh, anyway, so I got a Bebop 2 Power. I wanted to be able to compare and uh, show uh, people who have questions the differences between the two and things I found out about the power uh, compared to the just the Bebop 2. Well one of the questions that some people have been asking is when you uh, get the new charger that comes with the uh, with the Bebop pr power um, what does the the charging cable seems to have uh, an extra prong or an extra plug on it and of course it fits into uh, the the charger right there okay and so and I'm sorry I shake a lot but I've been shaking like that ever since I was in my 20s I think so anyway uh, I decided well I'm gonna figure out what that fifth wire goes to and uh, and is it really necessary so uh, I'll get set up here and I'll get it so that uh, we can get a good picture of this thing and I'll measure the voltages and we'll see uh, what that fifth wire which one is the fifth wire and what it goes to. So uh, uh, stay tuned here. Okay, I've got a few things stacked up here and rigged so that uh, I can get a good video or a good picture for you here. And uh, maybe I need to get this balanced a little bit better. There, that looks pretty good. All right, so uh, you can see the voltmeter and you can see right here is the plug with the with the five uh, wires on it. So we'll go ahead and uh, we'll take some measurements. Sorry about the rigmarole, but uh, this will work, okay? Looking at the charger, this would be the, the uh, pin that's clear to the right uh, as it goes into the charger, okay? So let's take a measurement here and see what we get. We'll go to this one. And it looks like we get full volt. Now, I'm, by the way, I'm measuring a, uh, I'll show you in a minute here, I'm measuring a Bebop 2 battery, uh, but so we've got 11.78 volts, and then as I come to the second one, we've got 7.86 volts, so the uh, we're going across the three batteries, it looks like. So then we'll go to the next one, and we've got 3.92 volts, and so now we're getting down to the end here, and we get zero volts. Actually, there's a little voltage reading there, but anyway, so uh, this, uh, the, the fifth wire is not connected to anything, but let's go ahead and move this over to here. All right, and we'll go back and do the same thing. And there's 11 volts. There's 7.93, and there's 3.96. So that fifth wire, has no use other than to make sure that uh, you don't uh, plug this into the to the wrong uh, to the wrong charger if you already have another charger. Let me show you something here. So now we know that this this last pin over here has nothing to do with the charging system. Okay, so you won't hurt anything if you uh, try to experiment around and burn something up because as we all know. There's uh, only four, let me get this off of here, and we'll get this off of here. And like I said, I'm using a, uh, uh, let's get this, let's just move all this out of the way. Uh, I'm using a Bebop 2 battery. And by the way, they have put a little uh, flap on there to make it so that you can't accidentally use the wrong battery. Uh, they don't want you charging one of these batteries with a heavy-duty uh, battery uh, charger because it would overcharge one of these. So they put this little flap on here to make it hard to uh, to go in, although it still does. So we know we have four four plugs there, and we have five pins out of, out on the end. But uh, the 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 fifth pin from where it says Bebop here, okay, that fifth pin is uh, probably just connected to EC they're not even used or it's connected to the to the last one so the, this would be the ground wire 
and these would go to the three um, three cells inside that battery. So anyway, that should answer some questions as to what is that fifth wire for, and I don't think there's a wire. Anyway, I want to thank you for watching, and God bless. All right, I know what some of you are thinking. Well, sure, of course it's not going to use that fifth wire if you plug it into the wrong battery. <laughs> so I thought, all right, uh, real quickly, I'll, I'll uh, run through the voltage check with a regular power battery. And as you might be able to see here, it's the uh, uh, 3350 milliamp uh, battery. There we go, that's better. So anyway, uh, we'll go ahead and, and real quickly measure those other voltage. All right, so we're gonna go through the same thing real quick and uh, measure the voltage uh, at each wire connected to a Bebop 2 power battery. Okay, so let's take a measurement. We'll go over here to the end and we get 13.07. And we go over here, and the second one in, we get 8.7 volts. And then the third one, the third cell, we get 4.34. And then if we come here, we get 0 one more time. So uh, that is working out the same as with the, uh, with the other battery, except it's higher voltages because it's a different battery. Okay, so uh, I want to thank you for listening and uh, putting up with me, and God bless you.